Okay, so the first thing you're going to want to do is go down to the rectangular shape tool button here, and if we click and hold it, we can select line tool. If we have a look at our options along the top, first of all, we want to make sure shape is selected from this drop down, and we have our fill and our stroke, which is going to be sort of the internal color and the outline color of our arrow, respectively, and I'm choosing white and black here. The, this value here is going to be the thickness of our outline, which I found 0 0.5 works pretty well in this case. If we scoot over to the right here, we'll see really where the magic is happening to create this arrow. And if we click this gear box, we see we have the option to start the arrowhead at the beginning or the end of the line. The width and the length are values that you might want to play around with a bit, but they refer to the actual size of the arrowhead. I found 500 and 500 works pretty well. And then the weight here is going to be kind of like the general thickness or size, I guess, of your arrow. Uh, again, you might want to play around with it, but 5 seems to work well for me. And then you just click and drag and there you'll have your arrow.